we got the man here, TF. Todd Frazier. How we living, dog? All right, how we doing? Good, everything's great. Everything's well, good. And, you know, we got to talk about you in this uh, all-star appearance and uh, home run in Derby. Okay. And, you know, I was on, a, I do a summer travel team. I was on the road with my team. <laughs> and we was in the hotel watching you. We was pulling from oh, the game, man. I'm sure. I know, I know. You see, you see the ball Stanton was hitting, man. It was a... Uh, it was an exciting one. Uh, uh, he was hitting some bombs. Uh, yeah, well, when he got out there, you know, up that's there, over 50, 60, yeah. like, oh, oh here we go again. Turn. I know. The, the series before I got faced up, Adam Duvall, he had, he had about six, 15 or 16. I still thought I had a chance when he hit 20. Um, just couldn't get in the groove, and that's just one of those things that happen, you know. Um, you know, winning it uh, last year, the year before last, or this year, um, was awesome. I thought I really had a good shot this year, but now, uh, you know, let's call spade a spade. We're going to Miami next year, and guess what? I'm coming for him again if I get that opportunity. Okay. Right in his hometown, so we'll see how it goes. So let's talk about that experience, just being among your peers and honored to be out there. Yeah, there's nothing better. I mean, you're talking to guys and pitchers um, included um, about the game of baseball and uh, the best of the best, uh, yeah. honestly. There's nothing better than that. Uh, you pinch yourself. Um, my, my son's in the locker room with us, two years old, Blake. <laughs> Uh, he calls Mike Trout Uncle Mike because we're real close, and uh, God, he's 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 giving high, high fives and uh, hugs to Big Poppy like <laughs> like he knew him all along, and it's uh, it's something that I hope he'll cherish that, and uh, you know, once he gets older, hopefully he'll get an opportunity to uh, do something like that, and I'm coming back with him because I want some dog pounds and hand pumps, baby. You know how it is. Hey, you know, a lot of people don't realize they see you guys competing against each other. Yeah. There's a camaraderie that goes on. Of course. Only with your own team, but with the players from different teams. Oh, of course, of course. When you step on the lines, it's a different story. Even though you want to have as much fun as possible, you want to enjoy this game as much as you can, and you want to make a lot of friendships. And, uh, you know, for me, uh, when the opportunity comes, man, I'm going to talk to anybody I can, whether it's a younger guy or an older guy. Even pick their brain, man. What are you thinking up there? You know, talk to mm -hmm. David Ortiz. Talk to, you know, Mike Trout. Talk to a pitcher, man. What would you throw against me? And then the next thing you know, they get traded. Next thing you know, they're throwing those pitches, so you're ready to go. <laughs> so there's a little method to every madness I yeah. do. So it's, uh, you know, that's the jersey in me, I guess. But at the same time, you want to be friends with everybody. But when you cross those lines, it's, it's, it's time to battle. So that's it. I talk about Quintana. He's kind of been a tough luck pitcher mm -hmm. on this team. But and he had the honor of making an all-star team this year. I was happy for him. He deserved that. Uh, from what I heard, he deserved two or three more. Um, he's a bulldog out there. He grunts when he pitches. Love it. Uh, gets on the mound. He does that double tap kind of thing mm -hmm. and goes. And he, he, he just just a guy that goes about his business every day. You know, flies under the radar, and uh, that's probably how he likes it. You know, yeah. and one day he's going to come out of nowhere. One year he's going to be in contention for that Cy Young, and he's going to battle his tail off. Love to play with him. Love to play behind him, and um, <clears throat> I'm happy to call him my teammate. Let's talk about yourself. We're just a little bit past the halfway point, and you got 30 home runs already. I <laughs> know, man. You, 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 you knocking over the 50 club? Or oh, what? man, I would love to. I, I heard the record was Albert Bell had like 49 or something. Um, God, if I can get it anywhere close to, I think that would be a good season for me. But, uh, <clears throat> you know, I've had 35 as my highest, and um, hopefully I can uh, meet that plateau if not go any further. Mm -hmm. So, man, will you... Just reflect back on the season. I mean, you know, is there anything that could be done differently? Yeah, um, finishing games, man. Uh, finding ways, you know, to, you know, that first, you think about the first month we had, 23 and 10. Mm -hmm. We go 500 from here on out. Mm -hmm. We're sitting pretty right now. Uh, you know, it's little things like that that I think of. You know, you got you take it month by month. You take it week by week mm -hmm. as a hitter every 10 at bats. You know, mm -hmm. you think of stuff like that. Don't overthink too much. But you come out the gates 23 and 10. Your next 33 games, you're, what, 15 and 16 so, or 15 and, you know, 18. Okay, you're still around that mark. If we stayed around that 500 mark, I think mm -hmm. we'd have been a little more closer contention. We still have a shot. We mm -hmm. still have a shot. I've seen crazier things happen. You're playing everybody in division. You're playing all the wild card teams, and mm -hmm. uh, there's a lot of opportunities out there. Is it still a fight in this team? Oh, of course, of course. We talked yesterday. We had a, you know, a brief hitters meeting, and um, you know, we got to be accountable for ourselves. Mm -hmm. We're all professionals. We've been here for a long time. Um, you know, whether a young guy in Timmy Anderson or an older guy in Justin Morneau, be professional. Mm -hmm. Take a professional approach every time you go out there. Coach Shaky Youngs is behind the scenes with the man TF. All right, man. All right, appreciate it. Thanks.